السلام عليكم ورحمة الله My theme is Sabr, Coping with Tribulations, Part 2 of a four-part series. My topic, Example of Prophets. Every human being goes through some form of trial and tribulations through life. And we find solace in our reliance on Allah and also on reflecting on the life examples of prophets, peace be upon all of them. We do know that prophets are models of excellence, chosen by Allah to guide humanity. Yet, all of them endured tremendous trials and tribulations. Ashaddu nasi bala'ul anbiya, the Rasul said, that the people who were most tried in their lives were those who were prophets. And they were, وَلَنَصْبِرَنَّ عَلَى مَا آذَيْتُمُونَ Most patient and persevering regarding the hardships they had to endure. And we reflect on the lives of the prophets, among them Ibrahim alayhi salam, who was thrown into the fire, was tested with the sacrifice of his son, had to deal with hostility in his household. Yaqub, who suffered separation from his son Nabi Yusuf, peace be upon both of them. Ayyub, who suffered severe illness and loss of the fruits of his labor. Musa alayhi salam, who had to deal with the oppressive authority of Fir'aun and also had to contend with the army of Fir'aun. Isa, peace be upon him, had to confront his people who forgot the spirit of the law. They challenged his mission, rejected him, and even wanted to crucify him. Even then he prayed, Allahumma ghfir li qawmi fa innum la ya'lamoon. Wallah, forgive my people, for they know not what they do. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wasallam lost his father before birth, was orphaned at the age of six, was rejected by his people when he conveyed the message. Despite them knowing him as a sadiq, the truthful, and al-ameen, the trustworthy. His companions were persecuted and some found refuge in Africa. He had to migrate himself from Makkah to Medina, suffered assassination attempts on his life. His followers were killed and his uncle's body was mutilated on the battlefield. He went days without eating and all his children, except Sayyidah Fatima, died in his lifetime. He often repeated the prayer of Isa in times of tribulation, Allahumma ghfir li qawmi fa innahum la ya'lamun. Once, while being insulted by someone in public, he was emotionally overcome, yet was overheard saying, May Allah have mercy on my brother Musa. He suffered more than this, and he was patient. May Allah's peace and blessings be upon each and every one of these prophets. These prophets, these exemplars of excellence who endured, and their endurance and their patience becomes a model for our patience. Shukran, wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Thank mm-hmm. you.